A big breakthrough came through the next day on July 2nd, 2025. Telescopes in Chile, Arizona, and Hawaii all took pictures that showed that the object had a faint coma around it and maybe even a small tail. This meant it was a comet. A comet on a path that was taking it out of our solar system could only mean one thing. It was from interstellar space. On July 2nd, the MPC made it official. The object was given two names, 3I Atlas, recognizing it as the third interstellar object ever found, and C slash 2025 NY Atlas. Its official name is a comet, honoring the Atlas survey that found it. To be absolutely sure about its path, astronomers need to know where it had been. They started a process called pre-covering, searching the archives of old sky photos to find the object before it was officially discovered. And the search was a massive success. They found pictures of it in data from the Zwicky Transient Facility from as early as July 14th, 2025. Even earlier images were found in data from NASA's test satellite, which had seen it between May and June 2025. The most important before pictures came from the new Vera C. Rubin Observatory. During a test run, it had taken high-quality photos of the 3 i Atlas between June 21st and July 3rd, 2025. If the observatory had started its test just two weeks earlier, it would have been the first to discover it. This is a powerful sign that once the Rubin Observatory is fully operating, finding interstellar objects will become much more common. You can't just chalk up the discovery of the 3i Atlas to just plain luck. It was the result from a system built for protecting the Earth from asteroid impacts. 